ordeals, distribution, economics, training, facility, etc. Today we have a panel of Mr. Bharat Binale, filmmaker, Karnataka, then Mr. N. Vidyashankar, festival director, Bangalore International Film Festival, then we have Shreyans Jain, filmmaker, Bikini, Rajasthan, and there are other people who are going to join later. Ms. Ranjana Patel, filmmaker from UK, and then uh, um, director and producer of film, father and son, Vietnam, will also join us later. So now I invite the people who have arrived on the panelists. Mr. Bharat Miralet, please come on to the stage, please. <laughs> Welcome, Mr. N. Vijayashankar, Festival Director of Bangalore International Film Festival. <laughs> Next, I welcome Dr. Shreyans Jain, filmmaker, Mekanin Rajasthan. Gentlemen, will so we will begin our uh, open forum. The filmmaking is is a changing scenario always, right from the, when it is invented and when it is continuing with the advent of technology. Uh, and there are so many uh, issues involved in it. In uh, the scenario is changing. <coughs> All of you. Now, let us listen to our panelists. Then we'll have a question and answer session. We can have an interaction. First, I request Mr. Bharat Mirale, filmmaker, Karnataka, to say a few words. Yeah, hi. So my name is Bharat and I'm an independent filmmaker from Bangalore. And so until now I have been making films on my own, sort of raising funds through hook, not so much by crook, but by somehow getting my funds together and making films. I also have an advantage because I write, direct and edit my own films, so that way I don't have to waste too much. <coughs> and yeah, it's exciting to be here. <laughs> you can present your observations on the changing scenario in filmmaking with whatever experience you have. Okay. So I, I think it is changing for the better. Filmmaking has become a lot more accessible to people. It's a lot easier for someone to make a film because now people are making, even your phones have very good cameras on them. Um, and you also have access to a whole bunch of resources online. So if you want to, if you watch a film and you want to know how a person pulled a certain shot off, you could actually find a tutorial, you could find people who've gone through great detail of explaining that. So I think everything you need is out there and it's a lot more accessible. Which also means there are a lot more films being made, which means competition is a lot more fierce. And you have to find a way to stand out somehow. I say that. How do you find scene of economic economics of the filmmaking and the distribution system? Okay, so right now I'm also coming from the film bazaar where this is a hot topic because uh, sales distributors and finding this is a big challenge for filmmakers, and especially with someone like me who's made a lot of short films. There isn't that much of a market for short films. I mean, you have to really find the right people to push short films because you can't really sell them. Um, but I do think it's improving. Things like the film bazaar, all that is great exposure for young filmmakers. And yeah, so I, I think it, it is improving a lot. With your experience, uh, do you have any suggestions with all your experience in the filmmaking? Do you have any observations to uh, improve or develop the system? 
the system itself, um, since one of the topic is also uh, viewing venues, 